Hello, this is Congressman Bob Dold. After passing 36 short-term extensions, late last year Congress passed a bipartisan five-year bill to fund our nation's highways, railways, and other infrastructure. The agreement included important provisions that I fought for to facilitate the redevelopment of Union Station and prevent a delay of the Chicago Transit Authority's red and purple line modernization project. This week, I was with Congressman Jeff Denham at the Deerfield Library talking about next steps to ensure robust transportation funding. I also wanted to take a moment to answer a question from William in Libertyville, and he asks, will you support increasing transportation funding? Ensuring that the Chicago area remains a transportation hub for the entire nation requires continued investment in local infrastructure. For too long, politicians have put off this investment. Our leaders have stood by and watched as our railroads and highways became outdated, increasing commute times and making traveling less safe. When people from our community commute into Chicago, outdated train switches create a congestion by slowing commutes by as much as 15 minutes each way on some lines. Career politicians in Washington and Springfield may not feel the impact of their decisions, but families in our community have to deal with the fallout each and every day. Infrastructure is also very important to creating a business environment where companies can thrive. Six of the nation's seven major rail lines pass through Chicago. Right now, it takes 48 hours for a freight train to get from Los Angeles to Chicago, but it can take up to 30 hours for a freight train simply to get from one side of Chicago to the other. That's why I've worked tirelessly to promote the transportation needs of our community and will continue to support increased and robust funding for transportation infrastructure. I stand ready to work with anyone on this important issue to provide much needed certainty for local governments, businesses, and families, and everyone who relies on our transportation system. As always, it's an honor to represent you in the United States Congress. Have a great week.